ओके इफ यू सी द एवरेज सैलरी स्ट्रक्चर For the freshers, maybe two to four lakhs. That is in average, I'm getting. And zero to five years, maybe they're getting two to six lakhs. Maybe some exceptional people will be there. They are getting maybe more than that. But in an average, in overall, in in India, I'm talking about not outside. Five to ten years experience, people getting four to ten lakhs. Ten to fifteen years, people getting five to fifteen uh, lakhs. So this kind of average. Even though fifteen years experience, there are also some people getting six lakhs. Also, some people getting twenty lakhs. Also, some people getting thirty lakhs, forty lakhs. Also, so after twenty, there will be a very minimum percentage will be there. So this kind of structure is there in India. Are you agree with me, or uh, there is a you have some different idea? Anybody? You may put it in chat box also. This is true, actually. Yes, sir. Absolutely true. The uh, salary structure, what you are telling, this is very, very genuine. Yeah, we are. Uh, so that is the right. trend. That is the trend. So how to how to uh, how to overcome from there? So what are the what are the aspects? What are the things we need to discover? What what we need to do so that we can get also high income, like uh, IT professionals. So that is that is the mission. That is my mission. So that everybody in construction industry, in MEP domain, they will uh, live life like a king. So very few engineers having required skill set as per company requirement, and there is a scarcity. There is a scarcity is there in the present market because we don't uh, getting the profound MEP engineers. Because I have also go through. Uh, I have taken interviews of the many many peoples. I have seen the people are coming. They are in paper. They are declared that they are good MEP engineers, MEP uh, manager, whatever. But in reality, they are not able to convey that message what they are telling in the paper. So that is and and they are not they are losing the opportunities. So that is happening. Uh, reason is that most of the junior level people they are coming from college they have a bookish knowledge only electrical or mechanical because they do, never gone through all those things obviously we also the same uh, 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 boat earlier also but there is now there is a things are changes now that the world is going very speed uh, moving uh, faster so you have to grab many things within a short time so that is the there is a gap there is a gap i am i am trying to uh, fill i am trying to fill uh, from the freshers they get the knowledge and implement and get a good job or do something better but the reality is that there is a survey there is a india today survey i have taken from google if you see what they are telling only 7% engineers engineering graduates they are employable based on their core field like what is what does it mean only 93% people are not getting job people are getting job but people are getting job not based on their core field like you are from the electrical background so you are not getting a job in your core field like a <clears throat> electrical some manufacturing company or some electrical based company they may divert it to the construction industry or the other industry uh, retail or many other sectors hospitals hotels okay they divert it to other sectors so they are not getting job based on their core field so that is the that is that is the india today survey it is not my survey it is india today survey it is displayed yeah. so that is a skill based job scarcity is there in the market 